Hi, this is Bearded Coffee Monkey, and I'm here with a unboxing of a Falcon Northwest talent system. This is a computer that I bought. Uh, it's a custom-built computer, custom paint job. Went to Falcon Northwest, got the works. And uh, one thing about buying a, a computer like this, you get a lot of comments and stuff like, oh, build your own, and, you know, come on, it's easy, and all that sort of stuff. And I have three real good reasons for not building my own computer. Uh, and it boils down to, uh, don't want to. That's basically it. I don't want to build my own computer. I'm a grown-ass man. I make a decent paycheck. I'd like to spend it on something I want to spend it on. Some people uh, buy custom hot rods or uh, buy maybe a custom gun from the uh, from the shop and have it built and custom built for them. I just wanted the custom built computer. So, you know, no hot rods, no expensive clothes, no, you know, fancy stuff. Just I spend my money on what I want to spend it on and I wanted to buy a, a computer for myself. The last Falcon I bought lasted me 10 years. Still plays games. Uh, still does great. I think I updated a, a graphics card and I think maybe a, a motherboard at some point along the way over the 10 years that I had it. And it's still upstairs. Still works. Now that I'm moving into doing a YouTube channel, video editing, uh, game capture, while playing the games, running the games at the highest resolutions and stuff, then it gets a little wonky. So I decided to get myself a new computer and go with that. So uh, feel free to leave your comments in the in the section below. But again, realize, don't want to build my own computer. I'm kind of, you know, I work on computers all day at work. I'm kind of the family default IT department. I take care of our printers when the wife's computer goes down, getting the kids' computers ready, iPads, all that stuff. I just would like a computer built the way I want it, fine-tuned, expertly crafted, painted, and sent to me. So let's check it out. I'm going to start off with the small box here, uh, and we're going to lead up to the big reveal. All right, let's start with the small box. I'm going to grab a knife. Okay, I've got my knife here. Uh, let's see what we have. I'm very careful to just get the top here. Put this in a safe spot. Okay, we have uh, some foam. Always fun. Oh, and a whole notebook. Uh, looks like, let's see, what is this? Wow. It's got the Falcon logo embroidered on the front. Nice handle to unzip it. And this is, whoa, this is pretty crazy. <laughs> this is, oh, wow. This is, I guess, the cables I need, extra cables or more cables. There are screws and little components and... Man, there's a, is this supposed to be all the parts for the computer? Oh, this supposed to be all the parts for the parts that were put in my computer. Okay, cool. And all the little manuals. Oh, nice. So it's all the disks and it's all the thing. I, I On this machine, I ended up getting Office pre-installed just to save myself the hassle of having to buy it again and redo it. And I had an old version of Office anyway. So all that documentation is in here for Office and I guess the video card drivers and all that stuff. So I have all my original Windows disks and driver disks and everything. Uh, all the original parts that came with the pieces I bought. And there is the system documentation, which includes my invoice, all the parts. This is the shipping checklist, the motherboard, device configuration, CPU type. Man, all hand, all hand written. Test game one. Oh, cool. Game testing, final Windows configuration. Audio. So pretty much this is all the details that they went through to get it ready. Uh, license certification, certification, uh, benchmark results, uh, power enough system. Pretty much, it's uh, keeping your system clean. It's kind of like this little manual here. And we got the car. We got some some of the main discs, uh, recovery DVD ROM, and ooh, emergency use only. So this USB drive contains a complete image of this Falcon system as it was shipped from the factory. Use of it will completely erase your hard drive and restore it to its factory condition. Do not use without first consulting Falcon support. Oh, so basically it's a 
for emergency only, uh, if I need to restore the system back to its factory default out of the box, they sent me a small uh, recovery disk on a USB key. So pretty much we have a nice big Falcon binder. Uh, very sturdy. Uh, so, Falcon binder, and we also have, oh, looks like a, a microfiber cloth, also with the Falcon Northwest logo. And, uh, oh, this is for my sound card. So this is the Sound Blaster external bit for my sound card. And anything else? Nope. Looks like we are ready to go on to the big box. Okay, let me get the knife again. All right, time for the main event, the big box itself. We have our big Falcon Northwest box. I believe I kept my other box for a couple years, uh, just in case, and I ended up using it to ship back to Falcon for some parts upgrades, for the parts upgrades, and also to have them install uh, some USB ports on the front of my uh, computer. But this one is a Falcon Talon. Last one I got was a Mach 5, which will now, I guess, become the family computer, but this one is his daddy's. All right. Uh, let's see. Oh, there's a manual on the inside here. Well packaged. Oh boy. Take this off here. Let's take this off here. And let's see what we have carefully cutting uh, under all this tape. Very secure, very padded. Hmm. Actually, if I just take this here, very carefully poke it open. Yes, padding underneath. It is on its back. So that's the power supply. This must be the top. Actually, I'll just pull it out from the back here. Uh, let's see. Come on. If I'm careful, and luckily I'm on the back here, so I'm not too worried about scratching any custom paint or anything. Ooh. Looks nice. Now it's time for some tearing. There we go. This will be... There we go. Wow, this is very tightly packed, very secure. Oh, at the bottom. We get a sneak peek at the bottom, too. Oh, <laughs> oh man. All right. And here is the new baby. Bearded coffee monkey. It's got my color blue. And on the other side, Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, man. That is smooth. This is an automotive finished paint job. They basically go in, take my art, put it on there, did both sides. We got some USB ports on top, and this is their talent case. I asked for my art with the white highlights on the grill work, and <laughs> oh, man, this thing is beautiful. Holy crap. <laughs> very, very happy. This is perfect. I mean, it took a while. I went back and forth with them on the colors just to make sure we had the right shade of blue. I think the one I originally sent was like a too light a blue, and I reset it back to the blue I wanted and talked to the painter directly to make sure we had the right blue, uh, sent him the art files, and he was able to blow them up to the proper size. Man, that is smooth. I'm going to get some close-up shots of this uh, for the end of the video, kind of moving over it so you guys can check it out. And then, uh, I think it's time to pop this sucker open and not only see how beautiful it is on the outside, but to check out how beautiful it is on the inside. Oh boy. <laughs> and I'll also put the specs for the machine in the description. Uh, basically, it's, it's my first time using SSD drives. My old one had some regular uh, Western Digital drives. Got some SSD drives, got a kick-ass video card, all kinds of good stuff. When top of the line, hopefully this puppy's going to last me another 10 years. So, let's take a look inside, okay?
Okay, so let's pop this cover off and see what we have inside. Well, the fan's connected there, but that's okay. We'll just put this little phone up there for to hold that in place. And there we have the insides. They also give us this handy little reference sheet that was in the box. Uh, proper airflow and there we go. Everything's placed certain ways. And anything else, even little... Uh, oh, this is for packing, just to make sure things are stable. Very good. But, man, look at that cable management. That is smooth. we got our card. Man, everything. Nice, neat. This is some supreme cable management. I'm going to get a close-up of those. As you can see, everything is very neatly laid out. Great airflow through the case. So from that cable there, which is attached to the fan, but <laughs> it's out of the way when the case side is on. Liquid cooled. I didn't go for overclocking, though. Um, you know what? I, I also went with a single video card. I had... Uh, I need this thing to last for a while. Uh, overclocking is is cool and all, but I need it to be my day-to-day -day computer as well as just doing uh, stuff for video capture and everything. So I think it's pretty much as good as it's going to get. I got my cards there, and it is one clean machine. So this is Bearded Coffee Monkey with his new Falcon Northwest Talon uh, custom paint, custom parts. You've seen the insides. It looks sweet. Can't wait to get this thing running. I'm going to go upstairs right now and hook this up. You girls, can you feel this? Is that crazy? It feels like, feels like glass, right? So what do you guys think? You like it? Yeah, I like the paint job. You like the paint job? Pretty awesome, like huh? <laughs> you like the buttons on top, too? I like those, too. Well, <laughs> awesome. Well, hey, thanks for stopping by. Uh, feel free to leave any comments, questions in the comment section below. The like it, if you like it, and uh, feel free to subscribe. And uh, I'll be doing a lot of gaming on this, so expect more videos uh, every week from Bearded Coffee Monkey and his new Bearded Coffee Monkey machine. See ya! Bye! Bye.